Okay, so we're heading out to Mr. Pixel Tech's new base, and it's on the completely opposite side of the map for me. So it's taken me a really long time to get here. And luckily there's a minecart track set up. Whee! It's also really, really glitchy. But uh, we'll ride this cart for a little ways, and then about halfway down the track, there's a sign, I think, that says, Get off here! <laughs> so... Uh, I think I might go ahead and fast forward through this part. I think it's pretty cool. But uh, Mr. Pixel Tech's also new on the server. He's been here three days, two days, three days. <laughs> I've only been here a week longer than, than he has, so we shall see what his place looks like. Where is the turnoff? There it is. And we stopped in time. Yep, Mr. Pixel Tech down that really long tunnel. Well, I'm going to cut it off here and meet you guys at the other end. <laughs> a sign on a sign. All right, be back in a second. Okay, we are almost there. And here's his portal. I want to see if I can sneak up on him. Uh, it looks like he's building a zigzaggy minecart track here. wonder if he might be down here. Nope. He's not at this end. So let's see if we can hop through his portal and catch him unawares. <laughs> And hopefully I don't die going through the portal. Ah. Some lag here. Oh, daytime. I hear something. Is that just sheep? It's got to be just sheep. wonder where he's at. Let's head up to the house and see if we can find him. Something just took damage. There he is! Hey, why is he punching me? I guess he snuck up on us. Hey, well, hey! There you are! I was hoping to okay. sneak up on you. <laughs> no, I was pillaring up and I, I saw some uh, shining white armor uh, poking out from my nether portal, so I figured. <laughs> yeah, I figured if you weren't looking in the general direction, or if, if it, you know, during the daytime, there was no chance of me sneaking up on you, but you got <laughs> me. You got me. So everybody, uh, Wolf is the reason that I have cocoa beans, sugar cane, and cacti. What, what, what's going on with that? You were saying something about pranks soon to fall. Or are these setting up for a prank? Do you need these things? No, no, not at all. Nope. I don't believe I don't, you. I don't need those things. <laughs> I don't believe you. I do want my cocoa beans back, though. You do? Oh, I have 17 of my chest. Oh, well, I only used about 40 of them on this thing. Really? At least I think I did. I used up everything I had in my ender, ender chest. Gonna I was going to make a little farm out of it, but... Oop, there's drop some. Actually, I was coming over here to give you some... Uh, give you some iron and some rails. Sweet. Because I heard you were building a, a nether cart track. Yeah. And getting here was a bit of a pain. It was a long ride. <laughs> yeah, Psyguy Ryan's uh, tunnel is uh, leaves a lot to be desired. <laughs> oh, it's it's far better than walking. 
No, 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 it is. And <laughs> that first part where you have to walk and then the last bit where you have to walk is, is not uh, is not fun. So uh, I was just uh, telling everybody that when you got here, because I saw you said you were uh, heading this way, that uh, we would uh, tell the story. So I'm going to tell the story. Feel free to interject any fun parts. <laughs> I get fun parts. Uh, but, uh, guys, when I was coming out here, I was shopping between three locations. Uh, the X coordinates don't really matter, but to give you an idea, the Z coordinates were at 16,422, 16,340, and 11,859. We're at 11,859. I started the furthest one out and tracked my way back. I was over here looking around, derping, 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 and this was going to be the last one I checked because, God, I was on, what, 18 hours that day? <laughs> and, That's a uh, long day. I was, yeah, I, well, I kept getting, I kept dying. It was, it was horrible. But I kept derping around, and the next thing I know, I die again. And I have, I had just taken all of the epic stuff out of a chest. And oh, your enchanted on. gear? Yeah, I had the enchanted gear. I had an, uh, let's see, I had an efficiency four uh, pick. Like, I had all kinds of good stuff, and I was like, oh, this is going to be awesome. And then I died. And <laughs> I needed a way to get back, so I did like three speed runs in a row. <laughs> and Wolf just kept running, trying to run from negative 10,707 on the X and uh, 5386 on the Z, which is where Psy Guy Ryan's base is out to here, and Wolf uh, offered to help me out with the nether. Uh, going through the nether to get here, because it hadn't occurred to me, because, you know, I'm a noob. So, uh, yeah, I guess from there, uh, he helped me dig my current tunnel, and that's, and then we ended up, god, what, probably about 75 to 100 blocks that way, right? Because I gave you the wrong coordinates. Mm, that way. It was over there. Yeah, that way. But past, in the in the nether, the in the nether, it's only a few blocks. Yeah, in the so nether, we were actually off like, by a few blocks. The nether's like what? Divided by eight. Divided by eight. There you go. Okay, divided by eight. Okay, so see, learned something. Um, so yeah, we set that up, and uh, he helped me get back here. Luckily, since nobody is out this far, uh, all my stuff was sitting in an unloaded chunk, and the timer didn't apply because that probably took us a good 20, 30 minutes. He went through like two diamond picks for me. Three. Three. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> they were all high efficiency, so I was just breaking them like glass. It was just ridiculous. Yeah, so the, uh, needless the nether, to say... The nether, it, uh, nether rack just melts under high efficiency picks. Yeah, no, it does. Needless to say, uh, Wolf kind of saved my butt. Um, <laughs> in more ways than one, I got my stuff back, and uh, I was able to get... Uh, I was able to get another portal set up as well, which was what I was really on that day to do was to set up this nether portal so I could commune with the rest of the world. <laughs> um, so, uh, ooh, you said you you had you has presents. I have some presents. You has presents. Let's let's go into the uh, the wood shack. It's now a wood shack. It's no longer a dirt shack. No, it's no longer a dirt wood nether rack. <laughs> uh, uh, what else was it made out of? Tree trunk, uh, sand shack. <laughs> sand, yeah, there was. I remember the nether rack in the roof. Let me get into my ender chest. I've got a block like of iron cool and a stack of rails, and we were gonna go put them in. What's this? Where did this come from? This is uh, well, this is something I built, and then I guess uh, Rich Twenty Seven added to it, and he uh, he left some stuff for me. He says there's an Jeez. Easter egg around. Yeah, he says that there's an Easter egg around, but I can't. Oh, the uh, the rails are from Rooster HD. You don't need this to... stack of iron, then. Seriously. Well, I do. <laughs> oh no, 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 the the stack of iron is a for building minecarts, and B, I'm gonna give those rails back because I think he misunderstood. I wasn't asking him for rails. Well, I would say use the rails before you give them back, because. <laughs> How am I supposed to do that? Rooster, Rooster's going to do that. Rooster's going to give everybody that shows up on the server a big gift basket. So yeah, that's true. That's just true. say, just say thank you and return whatever you have left over. Is what I meant. 
Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I thought you were saying, like, use the, <laughs> use the rails, and then take those same rails you just used, dig them back up, and be like, here, I've paid my penance for <laughs> the misunderstanding, and no, I, I, like, I feel bad about the misunderstanding, but there was no way that Here's happening. some used rails. <laughs> yeah, here's some lightly used rails. Thank God they don't have durability, uh markers on them see i'm not i'm not really worried about rails right now because both my bases that i've got set up are in abandoned mine shafts ah so i can just go just break a rails, few tunnels yeah. full of rails yeah the only problem i'm going to have is uh gold um for powered uh power tracks <laughs> Poor height detail. He's like, oh, never mind. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're power... both actually recording, if you didn't know. Oh, we are? Okay. <laughs> like I said, I was trying to sneak up on you and get it on camera. <laughs> Hi, Mom. So, uh, let's see. Uh, what well, would you mind... Um, if I use some of that iron to build iron picks and uh, you want to take a crack at uh, helping out with some of that portal, you don't have to. I'm just, you know, some you never, of the what? You know, it never hurts to ask. What helping you... me out with some of that tunnel? Tunnel. I probably said portal, but I tunnel, meant tunnel. Tunnel, tunnel. Um, uh, I would say get a mine going first. Use that iron to get yourself a mine yeah. before you tackle the tunnel. That's probably a because good you will burn through that burn through that iron before you ever get a chance to uh, to get some more. Yeah, that's probably a good point. Okay, well I might have to do that then. I wanted it to be my first project so I wouldn't have to spend. I I timed it. It's like uh, seven to eight minutes. Actually, I think I just upped it. Uh, I think it's just seven minutes, but still, it's pretty freaking long. To walk here? No, to uh, to take that whole tunnel here. Oh. Okay. You, you say that's about accurate? I, it felt like 20 to me. <laughs> well, yeah, being in it's different, but I actually looked at the clock, uh, and it looks like it's only about uh, seven to seven okay. to possibly eight minutes. But I, I'll double check. I was count I was also counting from me leaving my base. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. To yeah. walking all the way here. Well, and you're pretty damn far out, and you don't I have a mine track. It's like 5,000 out there. Yeah. And no, there's no minecart track yet. I was saving those rails, man. No, it's okay. Well, I've got three stacks. If you want. No, you no. Like All I right. said, I've got, I got sure, so much. Sure, just make me feel bad. <laughs> I am doing a good job, aren't I? Yeah, yeah, you are. <laughs> um... No, I've got I've got so much rail on the ground. I just have to go pick it up. Gotcha. Like I said, um, so I mean we're in a we're in extreme hills. Um, right now, I would say the most valuable resource on the server are villagers. Yeah. No, villagers villagers and gold, actually. Apparently, well, villagers uh, sell you gold. Well, they do, but by the same <laughs> by the same token, like uh, I was thinking that uh, a future build project um, might be a uh, zombie pygmy farm. That's an idea. And then we could do that and set that up for everybody to get some use out of, and then uh, powered rails don't become such a scary thing anymore because apparently there's very little gold going around in the server right now. I'm finding uh, tons. It's just, that's what I'm going to do, is I'm going to turn it into powered rails. Yeah. Okay, let's see. There is but a... Once we get a, yeah, once we get a zombie pigman farm, I'll be wearing this stuff. Heard. <laughs> you know, every, so I, hear... I, see, I see guys running around with uh, diamond armor on. It's like, yeah, that's that's nice bling, but... Wait till we bring out our gold armor. <laughs> People will yeah. be drooling over that. Yeah, it may not protect me too much in battle, but damn it. It looks shiny. 
Hey, come on down here real quick. I wanted to show you uh, one of the mines I found. I started lighting up. Which way? Uh, it's back up the mountain. It looks like you're down in the water. I'm in the water. I'm actually in the cave. Oh, you're. Oh, you're in the same cave I'm in. Yeah. I mean, this take I'm... all the fun out of life for me, don't you? I do. So yeah, guys, here, let me, uh, instead of just digging all this stuff up on camera, because that's not how I roll, I'm only going to do about uh, 15 to 30 minutes of uh, uh, bah, 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 caving per day. But uh, if you guys want to take a look, this is what we have to work with. Watch out for the spider. What's Did you get him? No, I didn't see a spider. I have my sound turned way, way down. Hold on, let me turn it back up real quick. Let's put it at about 20. Okay, I hear the spider, but I don't see the spider. I see him now. I see, oop, I'm trying to, to dig a hole with an axe. I think that skeleton sees you. Oh, yes, he does. I know he does. Broken axe. You just like to break tools for me. Well, I... On my behalf. Well, when I go nether, traveling in the nether, I equip the crappiest tools that I can get a hold of. Ah. Yeah, because you have <laughs> had some bad luck. Oh, guys, by the way, uh, Geomine um, recently transferred uh, hosts, so we're actually uh, Creeper. dealing with quite a bit less lag than normal. You're going to get yourself killed, man. No. No? Okay. Heard that. I need some, I need some torches. And I only took a... Uh, I'm uh, filming. Alright, ready. Retreat! So yeah, guys, this is the uh, first cave system we'll be exploring, and I'll put some footage up of that occasionally. Um, but I think for now, to save on what little time we have left, and uh, maybe make some progress on something, that we'll go ahead and dig out this iron first. But we will go ahead and... Um, Son of a biscuit, that's not what I meant to do. Um, that we will go ahead and uh, pause here and then probably pick back up because despite what uh, Wolf said, I think I am going to dig a little bit more of that uh, nether tunnel out. Uh. All right. Do you need help? No. You are way down there. Well, it's only because when you're... When you're jumping and you take damage, you tend to fly twice as far. Okay, so the question stands, do you need help getting back up here? No. Okay, do you know where you're going? Nope. I am... I have dwarf senses. See? Ah, not too bad. And you lit up part of my tunnel for me. Thank Did you. I? Um, these torches aren't yours? <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't put those torches there. Man, who has been all up in my cave system? Because I only put a couple down. And you'll notice that in my video there's a, uh, 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 a scrolling text that says hardy har har har. <laughs> it's like, holy I was going to be like, man, somebody is coming over here trying to steal. I did, uh, I did tell my, you I was uh, doing emeralds. some, I did tell you I was doing some terraforming. Yeah, that's true. You did tell me. No, I haven't been in this cave before. Wow, this is nice. Yeah, Wolf is actually quite sarcastic and tries to be funny. He thinks himself the next generic bee. Try, tries? Is tries being the keyword there? <laughs> I had to. I'm sorry. Absolutely. I behaved that now. Alrighty, guys, so we're going to pause here, and uh, Wolf may or may not be with us, depending on what he's got to do, but uh, I think I'm going to go dig some more of that tunnel and show you guys some progress that I make on it. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I hit you. Did you? Was that you hitting me? No. Because I swear I glitched as I was turning and stepping, and it decided that I didn't actually turn. Ah. And I, yet I still stepped. Oh, well. So I stepped into the vo the, the pit. <laughs> so you don't want to go get some, some iron and... 
Ah, my, ah, my cadence a little bit. All right, I really am pausing the video now. I thought you paused it a long time ago. <laughs> I thought I did too, but I've I've switched around my uh, my keys uh, for my binds. Oh. So. Okay, so I get, yeah, we'll dig out some of this. Yeah, let me turn up my game sound then if I'm going to be down here. Usually, what I do when I dig a mine is. I just dig a stair step down. I don't actually find a cave and do that. Um, I do that after a while, but primarily I like to uh, go through and make use of the existing systems to see what I can find. Mm. It still doesn't change the fact that I need some damn torches. Do you have okay. some wood on you? Yeah, I got some wood on me. You want some coal? I have some coal. I've got 22. I have a mo mushroom infestation over here. Awesome. God, remember back in 1.7 when they used to just be freaking horrible? No. I wouldn't I use that word. <laughs> I would oh. say freaking awesome. Uh, come on, I mean, I had one take over an entire biome. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, it was bad, and I was just like, what, really? Seriously? I mean, I, I took advantage of that and built mushroom farms like crazy. So, I was happy that they spread like that. Now it's just, oh, here's some red ones. Um, never mind. Do you want some red ones? Some red ones, what? Oh, some red one, some red mushrooms. Red wine. I've actually red wine. got some mushrooms up in the chest because oh. I'm going to do a mushroom farm. Okay. Well, it's actually going to be both a science for the win episode and a. Um... In my very first let's play, it was I'm thinking 15 or 20 episodes before I ever found any red mushrooms. Oh wow! They no, I found them um, during all my speed runs. Right. Okay. But I thought you lost everything during those. Um. No. Remember, we got the items back. Uh. I hear things. Yeah, I'm not seeing a whole lot of. Oh, there's some more coal. I'm seeing a ton of iron. Okay. Well, I'm not. I'm mis I'm either not seeing it or I'm just passing it up. You've become attuned to it. You've become to attuned to the to the iron lure. Like I have literally had single player worlds where I'll just stop mining it because I have so many stacks and stacks and stacks, and then finally I need some more, and I'm like, damn it. Of iron? Yeah. Oh, and if uh, if any of your subs want to watch more of the caving episode, the caving footage, yeah, I'm still recording. Okay. Because I mean, I'm not here to show progress on your your build. I'm here to show us goofing around and having fun. Absolutely. Um, if I give you some coal, will you give me some torches? Absolutely. Let's just block that off real quick. Awesome. Where Thank you. I don't know. Alrighty. One, two... Yeah, 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 I hear ya. There's some coal. Okay. Oh, damn. Alright. Let me... Hmm! Am I about to die? No. Okay. Did you find emeralds? You have okay. your F3 on? Hold on. Torches. Torches. Actually, awesome. there's uh, another half stack. Because I've got 64 on me. Ah! Half stack. F3? Yeah, I've got F3 on. Well, because I don't want to give away uh, numbers while I'm recording. So, I was just saying, check your Y. Alrighty. Uh, okay, I see my wild. Emeralds are in or, emeralds are in the gold layer. Alrighty. So thirty-two and below. Okay, so we're getting 
We're getting close. Oh, did I just throw my sword? Yeah, like a noob. I accidentally threw my sword. Hold on, I'm gonna go back and pick up some of this gold. I don't even have a sword. <laughs> Um, I was telling some guys earlier, uh, if you don't got a chainsaw or a baseball bat when fighting zombies in your zombie apocalypse, grab a shovel. <laughs> <laughs> yes, shovels will do the trick. Or a pickaxe. That's one clean shot to the head. Mm. Fighting water. Fighting. Uh, oh, this is this is surface water. Yeah, there's a there's a leak. Um, no longer, leak is plugged. There's a leak from this uh, uh, from the surface. Do I have a shovel on me? Oh, of course not. Let's build one. Oh, huh. you brought building materials? I brought. Uh, Oh, I've got cobble and I've got sticks. Oh. That helps. Yep. And I mm. always carry a crafting table on me. Hmm. What? Things that I should think about the next time I go adventuring? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I find carrying a crafting table on me uh, saves my life. For as much as I die, this is sad, but saves my life. Uh, more times than I can count. Oh. Yeah, I really should do some more, uh, say, adventure maps or caving episodes. Because it's usually never the monsters that kill me. Unless it's UHC. But Speaking of food, how am I doing? I got another thing of mushroom soup, some uh, rotten flesh, and some bread. And some have you done uh, UHC yet? No, I have not done UHC yet. Cause yesterday I was I was discovering that you've been way out of the loop. There was a machine at the spawn that you had no idea what it was, <laughs> and it's been pretty popular for quite a while now. Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, once I looked at it, though, I understood the basic concept because it's like the, um, that, uh, that flower generator. Um, the problem with the one that's on the server is it's using an old, outdated bud switch that no longer works. So let's go and fix it. It shouldn't be that hard. No, it shouldn't be that hard at all. It's just, I haven't had the time or the materials. And I'm not an expert on bud switches. I just borrow what other people have made. So I'd have to do research on a bud switch, on the current 1.3 bud switches. So, okay, well, that's been enough of this ca caving adventure. Um, we will cut it short. I've actually got some dinner sitting in front of me, so I will possibly pick up some recording later. Alrighty. Thanks for watching, everybody. You bet. This is uh, One Wolf. I'll be back in a little while. Don't go anywhere. Okay, sorry. Let me get out of the way here for you. Oh, you're fine. As long as you're not jumping, you're good. What? Oh, what? <laughs> What's that? You want me to stop jumping? Are you sure about that? Okay, and advance. <laughs> actually more interested in melons at the moment, so I will. Uh... You have to, for uh, for melons. Do you have any? There's oh, more. I've got some. Here, on. Let me uh, let me show you this. This is cool. Did you have any? Did you still have the pumpkin seeds I gave you? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I know you can mix them. I did a whole uh, stupid uh, episode on how it goes. Yeah. And they grow on tilled or untilled. See, mine's already produced a pumpkin. That was pretty cool. 
so you don't want that. But was this intended for wheat or? No, this is for melons. Yeah, you only need to till where you plant the seed. Yeah. Okay. It's kind of showing you we got uh, almost two stacks of iron, uh, just about four stacks of coal. Is this where the loot is? Actually, way more stacks of and a half of gobble. And uh, let's see, Wolf is helping me out here with uh, planting a melon farm. So helping? We gotta... You call that helping? <laughs> jumping up and down on the farm, that's helping. Okay, uh, yeah, <laughs> let me go do some more jumping. Well, I have different standards for, uh, shall we say, special individuals. <laughs> so, um, wow. Well, you are a special case. Not necessarily in a bad way. There's, there's a good context in there somewhere, I'm sure. But uh, so we are going to have a basic uh, melon farm up here for a while. Uh, a lot of this will get torn down as we actually build everything out. But for right now, um, food for everyone that's new has been kind of an issue and I'm sure False Symmetry is sick of me coming over to her place and uh, taking advantage of her like seven uh, her seven uh, tier wheat farm so I would say as long as you hang out for an hour and let everything regrow I don't think she has a problem yeah let's see if then I have things to do no I usually hang out but it's seriously seriously like last night I was gonna go to bed and then I was like oh crap I have to hang out and wait for this crap to grow back damn it so becoming self-sufficient is the name of the game and that's why you see all these little farms kind of scattered everywhere but uh, eventually there will be a rhyme and reason to them and they'll get cleaned up all right so um, sorry we didn't make any progress on the nether hub but I think wolf was right I think uh, Getting uh, some resources in in our belts was important. That we got a bunch of the caves lit up, and uh, I'll see you next time, guys. Okay, and this is One Wolf saying, "Have a good day." Actually, it's the middle of the night, so nice crescent moon. Yep. So have a good night, guys. See you later. See ya.